Don't you hate it when you're trying to take a picture or record a video and your iPhone says it's out of space? This is Craig from Clark.com and I'm going to show you some easy steps to free up storage space on your iPhone. If you're like me, your phone is full of photos, videos, and text messages you probably haven't looked at in forever. After a while, your phone may slow down and it may be impossible to take new photos or videos. Before you free up any storage, you have to find out what your biggest memory eater is. To do that, go to Settings, General, iPhone Storage, and you should see a bar graph that shows you what's using most of your space. Now that you know what's taken over your storage, here are seven ways you can create more space on your iPhone. Step one, delete your old conversations. Below the bar graph in iPhone Storage, you can set your old text messages to auto-delete. This alone may free up a gigabyte or more of space. Step two, review your large attachments. Another thing you can find on the iPhone storage page of your settings is the Remove Large Attachments section. Over time, you may have sent and received some huge files through email or text, and now it's time to delete them. Step three, get rid of apps you don't use. No longer play Angry Birds? Away with it. Not sure whether to delete an app? Scroll down in the iPhone storage settings to see the last time you've actually used it. If you find other apps you no longer use, scroll, delete, and repeat. Step four, turn to the cloud. Your iPhone's iCloud account comes with five gigabytes of free space. Upload your files to the cloud to save a little more storage on your phone. If you've already managed to use the five gigs of free space on your iCloud, you can use another free cloud account like Dropbox, Google Drive, or OneDrive. Step five, transfer files to a computer. One of the easiest ways to free up space on your iPhone is to hook it up to a computer and upload your files there. You can use a USB cord to make a connection and transfer your files over to your computer. Step six, manage your photos. The iPhone has several options to manage your pictures. You can either choose to automatically upload pictures to iCloud, remove them from your phone, or downsize them to a lower resolution. To manage photos, go to Settings, Photos. From there, you'll see the option to 1. Stop automatic photo uploads to iCloud. 2. Remove photos and videos. 3. Turn off photo stream and four, optimize iPhone storage. All of these save measures can preserve lots of space on your iPhone. Step seven, buy more storage. If you're the sentimental type who likes to save everything, you can always buy more space. If you've used all of the free space in your iCloud or another cloud account, you can buy more storage from that company. Then you can sync your device to free up space on your phone. By doing all the steps or sticking to a few, you'll be surprised by how much storage you can regain on your iPhone. What do you do to save space on your phone? Let us know about your data saving techniques in the comments. And subscribe to our YouTube channel and watch our other videos to learn more.